Hey guys, it's Matt. Welcome to Speed Shooter and welcome to Made with Unity Mondays for the 11th of July 2022 where I feature some of the best games, creations and everything made in Unity and be sure to check out all the links in the description for all the best savings that I've put into one video and, and all of the free assets for this month. And be sure to check out an awesome asset from Hoax Games and this is a premium asset called iStep which is a foot placement solution for Unity and it's an ability to be able to make sure foot placement is perfect upon any surface that your character places the foot along. So you've got drag and drop integration with this asset, smooth foot placement, robust body placement and it works across demos for HDRP, URP and the built-in render pipeline. I'll put the link in the description. So first of all, we We've got Gregory Oliveira that's been working long and hard on an animation using timeline, cameras and lighting. Boring Metaphor has got a Unity environment created in URP specifically for his portfolio. A Sarge has got boarding through the desert. Hatchling has added more water, swimming and physics for all the fun in the active ragdoll game. Do be sure to throw a like on this video and make sure you're subscribed to always be kept up to date to what I'm doing. Be sure to check out my Patreon to get access to over 145 different scripts, assets and projects. CD Projekt Red has got their new standalone game, The Rogue Mage. Chicken Nut, a HLSL shader which allows you to see through objects. UG Tools has got after years of hard work is officially releasing Ultima XR for absolutely free. Little Mountain Anim has got a HDRP virtual camera and Ziva to make a dancing dinosaur. Snickerbar maybe has got a tent one at realistic camera movement and that back room's kind of aesthetic. Yeah, Huzz has been making progress on a brand new BMX game with all the physics looking so smooth. The Unity Shader Bible has released the physical copy on Amazon which you can buy today and you might want to check out if you take your shader goodness to the next level. Pavonis Interactive has got Terra Invicta with the Warring Nations battling enemy fleets and everything that you can see here. Mr. Leap has got an origami pop-up book demon.
Mobby a Dej. And you can command your army on the battlefield in a game jam entry. War Greeks. Eric Wee has got a Unity Blockout tool. Ultramarine Afterglow has got ECS with 10,000 cubes with physics, joints and trails. Lord Halo has got some more footage for the trailer with some slick looking moves. M underscore Hakazaki have got the fish AI that are back again which can interact in real time with new objects and things that they like to eat. Quadile has got an update for the modular houses asset pack, free to everybody that owns this pack already, and look at the awesome new package. Sniper ED007 has got reef based coral fish with the visual effects graph and the shadow graph. Just Game Dev is building a tiny little island with new props and just look how sweet it is. Be sure to check out all these awesome creations and be sure to send me a message if you have anything else you'd like to show. Do come and check out my Patreon to get access to over 145 different scripts, assets and projects you cannot find anywhere else. Come and join me on Discord if you want to chat and check out my great assets on the Unity Asset Store along with massive discounts on my website for all of those great assets which I have been updating recently. Big thank you to all my patrons including Peter Steiner, Raheem Whittaker, Gene Pomier, Manos Barakas, Terence Conrad, Gage Lindstrom, Walter Dunstan, Joseph Newman, Rene Leisure, Darren M, Tofa Chambers, Ishtak Samani, Gary McGee, Christian Selen, Skaya Skaya, Benjamin Shankel, HK, Amanda Ditami, Alex Shen, William M, Jiraiya Sensei and Krashnik Halili. So thank you to everybody else who comes to watch the video. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Cheers.